Good morning, I'm Faye Thompson. This morning we're going to do tomato gravy. We're going to start off with one tablespoon of shortening and we'll light this up to about medium high. It's a whole lot better if you have hot biscuits with it. I went in the grocery store lately. Of course, I make my own biscuits, but you know, uh, I could not find any biscuits in two or three different stores. Oh. First time I ever seen uh, the stores that didn't have biscuits. In the store, it's those in the can that you bake. You can't find those. Okay, we're gonna put two tablespoons of flour, and I'm gonna go ahead and mix my salt and pepper into this. I used a table, a teaspoon of salt and about a half teaspoon or a little more of pepper. You don't want to let this get too brown now and burn it or anything. It wouldn't be good. But you let it get pretty dark. Now this is ready to pour one and a half cups of water, except I'm not going to pour it all on there at one time. And I'm on, I've got 15 ounces of tomatoes, and they were the pureed tomatoes, but I pureed them again. I like mine chopped up pretty good, but that's up to you, whatever you like. We're going to cook that a little bit, and then we're going to add the rest of our liquid to it. We'll put the rest of our water in it. Put the rest of our tomatoes in it. You know, I like tomatoes in almost everything. I don't know. I sure do eat a lot of tomatoes. When they're in season, I eat them for breakfast. They're, all of our tomatoes in the Delta, Arkansas are delicious. So I guess we have the kind of soil for them. Now, that's about all there is to tomato gravy, and you want to serve that with a hot biscuit. It looks about right to me. Now we finished our tomato gravy, and we're going to serve that over some hot biscuits. And I really do like this because I like tomatoes a lot. So I hope you try this, and I hope you enjoy it as much as my family does. Thank you for watching.